Good morning, students. Today we are going to learn about Roman numerals. Roman numerals. The Roman numeral system is ancient system of numeration invented by Romans. Okay. Even today we use Roman numerals in clocks and watches. Did you see that one? The Roman numerals. Some of the watches you can use inside the Roman numerals okay the symbols i b x l c d and m this is the symbols okay i b x l c d and m used to for writing roman numerals is to for writing Roman numerals. What are the symbols? I, V, X, L, C, D and M. Okay. Then first the basic seven symbols and their values in Hindu Arabic system are given below. First you can here I will try it. Okay. Mm, first one Roman numeral. numerals then is to one values is to one values okay is to one roman numerals are symbols what are the symbols here you used i first to one i okay i b x l c d Last one, M. Last one, M. These are the basic seven symbols, common numerals. Okay? Okay, students. Then, here. I, B, X, L, C, D, M. Okay. Kiss dance. Then first we learn the values. Okay. I for 1. I for 1. The value 1. Then V, 5. V, 5. X for 10. L for 50. C for 100. D for 500, then M for 1000, okay. These are the values, first one, Newman, Roman numerals, then values. This is the Hindu Arabic numbers, okay. This one is the first I for 1, B for 5, X for 10, L for 50, C for 100, D for 500, M for 1000. Okay. Then some of the rules are here. First one, if the Roman numeral, first rule, okay, this is the first rule. If the Roman numeral is greater in the left side, if the Roman numeral is greater in the Roman numeral, numerals, greater in the left side greater in the left side then we add it okay then we have added then we have added for example if the roman numeral is greater than left side then we have added for example i write one roman numeral x i okay then here this roman numeral left side is greater okay roman because x for 10 x for 10 then i for 1 i for 1 so the roman numeral greater than left side here 1 which one is greater here 10 so the roman num numeral is greater than left side roman, roman numeral greater than left side so what do you do on add it okay here this one you can add it then 10 plus 1. 10 plus 1 is equal to 
What's the value? 10 plus 1 equal to 11. Okay, this is the first root. Then next I write another one example. L, X, B. Okay, then L for? You study this value. Okay, L for 50. Then only problem do for EC. Then X for 10. Then B for 5. Here also the Roman numerals greater than left side. Here 5, then as 2 and 10, 50. So left side value is greater. So we have added. Add all the value. 50 plus 10 plus 5. Okay, 50 plus 10 plus 5. Then 50 plus 10 plus 5 is equal to 50 plus 10, 60. 60 plus 5, 65. Okay. This is the first rule. Okay, then second rule. If the Roman numeral is greater in the right side. Roman numeral greater in right side. If the Roman numeral greater in right side, then we have to subtract it. What's the second rule? Roman numeral greater in right side then we have subtract it okay for example for example 1 i x okay i x it's meaning 1 then i for 1 x for 10 here the right side value is greater here the right side value is greater then what do you do on here Subtract it. Okay. 10 minus 1. 10 minus 1. Subtract it. 10 minus 1. 10 minus 1 is equal to 9. What's the answer? 9. Then another one example. C M. C M. Then here. C for, C, ten, uh, for 100. C for 100. Then M for 1000. M for 1000. So here the Roman numeral greater than Greater than right side. Okay, here 100, here 1000. So, what do you do on? Subtract it. 1000 minus 100. 1000 minus 100. 1000 minus 100 is equal to how much? 900. 900. Okay, 900. Did you understand this one? Did you understand this one? Students, then next rule. First rule, the Roman numeral greater than left side. Then we have added. Then second rule, the Roman numeral greater than right side. Then we have subtracted. Okay, then next one. Third one. If the Roman numeral is repeated up to three times, only you can write that Roman numeral three times repeated up to three times to form a number. It cannot be repeated more than three times. Okay, only you can repeat the Roman numeral. Roman numeral is repeated up to up to three times okay three times only can writing the roman numeral is repeated up to three times it cannot be repeated more than three times for example for example can writing the number i i mm. then i i means 1 plus 1. 1 plus 1 is equal to 2. Okay. Then I, I, I. Then I for 1. Next 1 plus 1 plus 1 is equal to 3. Okay. Then this is the third rule. Okay. Then X. X means X for 10. X for 10. X for 10. So X, X means 10 plus 10. 20. Then X x x means 10 plus 10 plus 10 is equal to 30 okay then write the roman numerals is repeated up to three times don't write four times or many times only up to three times only possible here this is the rule okay then next rule fourth rule 
this fourth rule okay larger number like multiple of thousands multiple of larger numbers like multiples of thousand are represented by using the bar how do you can represent this one larger number like multiples of thousand are represented by using bar using bar over the number the number up you put one bar for example for example one b one b can put one bar then what's the meaning this one one b then one for hmm? one then b for five then here if the roman numeral is greater than in the right side so you can subtract this one 5 minus 1 bar you will write okay then 5 minus 1 4 bar then this bar meaning what's the meaning of bar that is the multiple of thousand okay multiple of thousand this bar meaning multiple of thousand so 4 into thousand 4 into thousand is equal to 4,000. 4 into 1,000 is equal to 4,000. Next one example. D bar. D for? D for? 500. Okay. D for? 500. So, D bar is equal to 500 bar. Then, bar meaning 500 into 1,000. Okay. 500 into 1,000. So, 500. 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. So, what's the answer? 5 lakhs. 5 lakhs. D bar means 5 lakhs. Did you understand this one? Did you understand this rules? First one, the Roman numeral greater than left side. Then we have added. Then we have added. See here, this is the left side is greater. So, you add the number 6 for 10, I for 1, 10 plus 1, 11. The next rule, the Roman numeral greater than in the right side. The Roman numeral greater than in the right side. Then we have subtracted. Then we have subtracted. Okay. Then I, X, I, X, I for 1, X for 10. Here the right side value is greater. Right side value is greater than subtracted. 10 minus 1. 10 minus 1 is equal to 9. Okay. Then third rule. Roman numeral is repeated up to 3 times. Roman numeral is repeated up to 3 times. It cannot be repeated more than 3 times. Okay. This is the third rule. Um, then next one. Fourth rule. That is the larger number like multiple of thousand are represented by using a bar using the bar over a number number up you put the one bar so here i b i b bar i b bar means this is right side is greater right side is greater so you can subtract it 5 minus 1 5 minus 1 is equal to 4 bar 4 bar means 4 into bar means you will multiply into that number into 1000 okay so 4 into 1000 is equal to 4000 did you understand this one did you understand Sren? Uh, shall i move the example question yes or no yes uh, then right the given this is the example question okay given roman numbers in hindu arabic numerals okay first question a part M C X L. Okay. First of first question. M C X L. Okay. Then how do you find out the value? Then first you write it. M for M for what's the value? M for M for thousand. Okay, M for thousand. Then C. C for 
hundred. Thousand hundred. X for ten. Then L for fifty. Okay. Then here, how to write the values? First one thousand. Here the right side value is. Hmm. Check it here. What's the rule here? You will use. Hmm. The Roman numeral is greater than. Greater than left side. The Roman numeral is greater than left side. So you can add these two numbers. Thousand plus hundred. Okay. Thousand plus hundred. Check it here. This one is ten. This one is fifty. So which one is the bigger number here? This is the bigger number. The Roman numeral is greater than in the right side. The Roman numeral is greater than in the right side. So you can subtract this one. Okay. How to write this number? Fifty minus ten. Fifty minus ten. Then thousand plus hundred plus fifty minus ten. Forty. Fifty minus ten. Forty. Then thousand plus hundred. Thousand hundred. Thousand hundred plus forty. Thousand hundred and forty. Thousand hundred and forty. Okay. Because these two numbers are first one is the Roman numeral is greater than the left side. Okay, here thou hundred, here thousand. Left side is greater, so we will add it. Thousand plus hundred. Then next here we will check it. The Roman numeral is greater than in the right side. The Roman numeral is greater than in the right side. Here ten, here fifty. So we will subtract it. Fifty minus ten. Fifty minus ten equal to forty. The answer so thousand hundred and forty. The next question B. M. M. D. C. C. X. B. Okay. Then one by one. First you find out the value. M for already you know thousand. This is M for thousand. Then D for five hundred. Then C for Hundred next C for hundred X for ten V for five V for five. Here you can check here if the Roman numeral in the enter in the left side. Great five ten hundred hundred five hundred thousand thousand. So if the Roman numeral is greater in the left side, greater in the left side. So you can ah uh, add it one by one. You will add it thousand. Plus thousand plus thousand plus five hundred plus hundred plus hundred plus ten plus five. Okay, then thousand plus thousand two hundred. Okay, two hundred plus five hundred thousand plus thousand. Sorry, two thousand thousand plus thousand two thousand. Okay, two thousand plus five hundred two thousand. Five hundred, two thousand five hundred plus hundred, two thousand six hundred. Then two thousand six hundred plus hundred, two thousand seven hundred, two thousand seven hundred plus ten, two thousand seven hundred and ten, two thousand seven hundred and ten plus five, two thousand seven hundred and fifteen, two thousand seven hundred and fifteen. Okay, did you understand this one? Because here the Roman numerals. Is greater than in the left side. Left side, all the values are greater. Left side, all the values are greater. So you add and write it. Okay. The next question. D bar, L bar, M, C, M, X, C, I, X. Okay. This is the question. Then D for five hundred. This bar means multiply into thousand. Five hundred into thousand. Okay. Then L for fifty. L for fifty. Then M for thousand. C for hundred. M for thousand. X for ten. C for hundred. I for one, 
then x for chain okay uh, then here first substitute here d bar d bar means d for 500 500 into 1000 500 into 1000 plus next value is right side here the right side value is greater then next you will write it 50 into bar l bar okay so 50 into 1000 50 into 1000 50 into 1000 because the roman numeral is greater than in the left side here 50 here 500 so you add it plus 50 into 1000 plus next here also 100 here 1000 so the left side is greater left side is greater so you will write 1000 as it is you will write 1000 plus plus then see here here the left side value is hmm? greater or smaller smaller value so you will subtract it okay subtract it here right side value is bigger value greater right side value only greater value so we will subtract this one subtract this one hundred thousand minus thousand minus hundred okay thousand minus hundred because what's the reason here the roman numeral is greater than in the right side right side is greater so you can subtract it then here also the roman numeral greater in right side here 10 here 100 so right side value is greater so subtract it okay subtract it 100 minus 10 plus then next value here you can see here here also the roman numeral is greater than in the right side so here also we will subtract it 10 minus 1 10 minus 1 okay uh, then 500 into 100 500 into 100 then 5 lakhs okay once 10 100 thousand 10 thousand lakhs so 5 lakhs then 50 into 1000 50 into 1000 here how many zero one two three four zero will write it so 50,000 50,000 plus 1000 plus here 1000 minus 100 900 plus 100 minus 10 90 10 minus 1 9 okay then you will add it one by one 5 lakhs 5 lakhs then 50,000 the next one thousand nine hundred ninety nine so zero 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 last nine so we'll write it nine zero plus zero 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 plus zero 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 plus zero last zero plus nine nine here also zero plus nine nine zero plus nine nine here zero plus one one zero plus five 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 okay so What's the answer? 5 lakhs 51,999. Okay, did you understand this question? Here, the right side value is, see here, the right side value is greater. Right side value, greater. Right side value greater means subtract it here also the right side value greater so you will subtract it then next also the right side value greater so 10 minus 1 that like you will write fully then first you can add it and write okay then next one last part c d l x x v i i then c for C for what's the answer? C for hmm? Hmm. 500. Okay, C for 500. D for 100. D for sorry. C for 100. D for 500. Okay. C for 100. D for 500. L for 50. X for 10. X for 10. V for 5 i for 1 here also 1 okay 
see here the left side value is greater left side value is up to this much greater here you can see here 100 and 500 here which one is greater which value is greater here right side value or left, left side value right side value greater so what do you do on hmm? can subtract this one okay right side value is greater then subtract it how to write this one 500 minus 100 500 minus 100 because here right side value is greater so you can subtract it remain you will check it left side value is greater okay that is greater than roman numeral is greater in the left side roman numeral greater in the left side 1 1 5 10 10 50 so you add it 50 plus 10 plus 10 plus 5 plus 1 plus 1 okay then 500 minus 100 400 plus 50 plus 10 plus 10 plus 5 plus 1 plus 1 then 400 400 plus 50 450 450 plus 1, 10 460 460 plus 10 470 then 470 plus 5 475 475 plus 1 476 476 plus 1 477 okay did you understand this question hmm? using the rule and find out the answers okay did you understand this question then the homework questions you will mark it the homework question homework exercise exercise 1c page number 21 okay first one then fourth one c e f g okay this is your homework question do it okay the same model question using the rule and find out the answer okay thank you students